Hello beautiful people, welcome back to Shredmas. Today we're gonna to be running through Pilates vibes, inner thighs, and obliques. One of my absolute favorites to run through. Um, no props today, and we're gonna get straight into it lying down on your side. So I'm gonna lie down with my left arm out underneath me, which means my right leg is gonna cross on top, my left leg is long underneath. To start, I just want you to stretch yourself out as long as you can like a pencil. Make sure you've got a little gap underneath your waist so you can slip your fingers there. And think of pulling your hips away from your shoulders. From there, we're gonna think of moving from your inner thigh. So this part of your leg, think of popping a cup of tea on your heel. I just want you to lift that cup of tea up and then gently down, down, down. Exhale, we lift. And we lower the shape back down. Good, so it's not gonna be a huge movement. What I want you to focus on is not shuffling around here. So we don't wanna dump down and kick the leg up. Keep it nice and controlled. It's just a little float and drop. It does not take much to get this muscle going. Something that it's kind of hard to isolate. So when we do isolate it, it's a lot. Good, two more. One more, next one, you're holding the shape lifted. From there, can you take tiny circles forward for five, four, three, two, and one. Reverse, five, four, three, two, and one. Freeze and pulse, 10, nine, eight. Lead from the heel, not the toe. Keep going, five, four, three, two, one. We freeze the shape there. From there, gently drop that leg down, uncurl your top leg, and you're sliding yourself up now, coming onto your elbow. From there, uncurl the leg, so the top leg now goes behind. I know, a little bit confusing. Other leg is coming forward, so it's kind of on a 45 degree angle, hands coming behind the head. Make sure you're nice and proud through the underneath side, no dumping down. From there, again, lift from the heel. We gently float the heel up, gently melt it down. Exhale, lift. And lower. Once we've got that leg going, and you can feel the inner thigh driving the movement, we're gonna add a little twist through the chest, up and across, and down, exhale. So you're trying to close the gap between your ribs and your hips here. Think of that top shoulder blade twisting over into that underneath hip pocket, Right. Still nice and proud, check on that underneath shoulder. In two, in one, reset the chest, hold the leg there. Can you float your other leg up to meet that top leg, cross the inner thighs? You're reaching that arm long now towards your toes. From there, we start to beat the leg, so it's a change, change, change. Change, change, change. We change, change, change. Four, five, four, three, two, hold the legs crossed. Pulse the shape together, guys, go. 10, eight, Last five, four, three, two, one. Gently melt it down. Oh my God, there are the abs. <laughs> From there, guys, you're coming onto your side now. So fully back onto that elbow. You have the option to either stay on the elbow or you can come up onto your hand. I'm gonna come up onto my hand today. Take the top arm long. Hand underneath the shoulder, float that top leg up, up, up. From there, we start to bend the leg in. Exhale, reach long. Inhale, bend. Exhale, reach. So although we're using that top leg and that top side's moving the most, I want you to feel the obliques underneath nice and strong supporting you. Beautiful guys, from there we're gonna take a combo. We're gonna go in and out. From there, rotating onto your hands. We take a push up down and then we twist back, reset the shape up. We go in, out, rotate, push up. Reset, open. We go in, out, twist. Bend, stretch, rotate across, and down. Gorgeous team, you've got two more that sets there. Bend, reach, twist. We melt down. Final one. Face me once more, lift the leg up nice and high from there. Lift it, lift it, lift it, arm goes long as well. Hold the shape here, we're pulsing from your hips. We've got 10, nine, eight, 
six, four, three, two, one. Oh, that was a shame. Down, guys. Fall into a little mermaid. Stretch yourself up and over. Swing yourselves around, slide yourself down. Let's come all into the other side. So this time my left leg's on top. Oops, right leg is on underneath. Pull the shoulders away, gap under the waist. When you're ready, off you go, we float. We tap, exhale, lift, and lower. I just ate so much food, and oh my God, I can feel it. <laughs> <laughs> Cup of tea on the foot. I think it's something a bit more exciting. Hey, let's go a cocktail on the foot. Don't you dare spill that. That's highly valuable content. Two more. One more. You're holding this next one. Ah, draw your circles forward. Five, four, three, two. One, reverse, five, four, two, one. From there, guys, we're going little pulses in the center. Up, 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 stretch the leg long, longer. Four, three, two, hold for a second, lift. Gently melt it down, uncross those legs, sliding yourself up onto the elbow. Hand comes back behind the head, long through the underneath side, long through the leg. We're starting to float the heel up, gently down. So again, that inner part of the thigh, what's driving the movements. We don't want to kick, really control. Don't stress about how high your leg is. As long as you can feel that, you're doing it right. Once you've got the movement going and you want that option, we add that twist. Release. Exhale, twist. 